Hi, I'm Josh Maurer. Welcome to UMass Football Media Day. This is a day where about 20 members of the accredited media have come out to check out the 2008 version of UMass Football. Well, we thought we'd take a different angle here on UAT. UMassAthletics.com. We thought that we'd talk to some of these guys maybe about non-football issues, such as perhaps, oh, since we're talking about media interviews, what's the dumbest question that they'd have ever been asked? Let me see. Where do I see myself in 30 years? I was asked a question, and I honestly said I don't know, so <laughs> that's about the craziest question I've been asked. Oh, uh, you know these like little red things right here they put on the fence? Uh, somebody asked me if when they put them if it was going to help me with the wind and stuff. They don't understand that the wind is higher than the low fans. So that, that was pretty funny, though. Um, last year, they asked uh, who had the better hair between me and Rashid, and I had to go with me because I said uh, curls for the girls over the length. Who is the tallest guy on the team? I think it's uh, Ben Coblin. He's like 6'12", 7 feet tall. I don't know. He's pretty tall. So you can't really measure up to him height-wise? No, not at all. He's a, he's a big guy. But uh, but your hair, how does that compare to Ben's little afro do? <laughs> now Ben has at least like four or five inches with the afro, so he towels over everybody else. It's like a Persian yeah, rug. Mine's, way better. Mine's, way Mine's softer than a Persian rug. It's like a sheep. Whoa, don't mess it up. It's yo. like a sheep. Fire. Don't mess it up. What do you call your haircut? A blowout. Not an afro. Uh, it's an afro, but it's a blow because I got it, I got it lined up last night. What's the difference? Afro's just a little natural. It's got a little more round, like a little space ball look to it. You sound like an expert. Yeah, I've had long hair for a while. <laughs> if you had to provide a pregame meal for the team, what would you pick? Uh, I've definitely got to say, have to go with uh, my Jamaican jerk chicken with some uh, nice bacon macaroni. Even though our stumps would be hurting before the uh, game, but it's what I love to eat. <laughs> uh, my mom's homemade pasta. Yes, she makes pasta from scratch. I'm looking forward to that when I get 48 hours off. <laughs> would you try to get her to make that for a pregame meal? Do you think that would work for the team? Oh, man, I don't think guys would move after that. They would just want to take a nap. That's, that's, the, after, that's the side effects for me. I just pass out on the couch. What's your favorite food? Pizza. Pizza's like a definitely pizza. If you could make a pregame meal that the whole team was going to eat, would it be pizza? Nah. I think I'd have, like, junk food, like, power or something. <laughs> <laughs> but that wouldn't be good because then you'd have to play a game. I know it wouldn't be good, but that would be my choice of food. <laughs> I don't think the alignment will um, disagree with it. <laughs> so UMass footballers, if you were a superhero, which one would you be and why? I'd probably be Batman because uh, he saves and does good for the, uh, for the community. And uh, no one knows who he is. So he's like a a good superhero does good things and uh, doesn't take the credit for it. So he's a humble guy. Uh, I would have to say Spider-Man because I just like the way he climbs up walls and shoots his web and stuff and, you know, goes from building to building. I think I'd be uh, Aquaman because uh, I like the ocean. And uh, I don't know, it's pretty cool like swim around the water and just breathe on the water. It's pretty cool. But Aquaman's not a real superhero, is he? I mean, he breathes on the water. He controls all the... The sea animals and stuff like that would be pretty cool, no? So there you have it, a couple of insider snippets from the UMass football team. This has been our coverage from Media Day here on UMassAthletics.com. Again, be sure to check back through at camp as we continue to provide just about daily updates. Thanks for watching again. I'm Josh Maurer.